I'll never forget when I was named Outstanding Young Artist of the Year by the Hubbard Falls Women's Club. <laughs> and the other night I looked at the trophy and the year that I was artist of was 1982. That's a long time ago. Once again, Rainbow Motor Oil and the Rainbow family of automotive products presents the story of Bob, a young artist. I've been working on my conceptual poem, Lost Words, Found Words, hoping to get it into the October Arts Festival. Kind of a comeback, I guess. The Story of Bob, starring Carson Weiler as Bob, and written by Sarah Bellum. You didn't eat that tapioca pudding I made for you, Bob. Is something wrong? Well, I'm just not hungry, Bernice. Well, I, I made orange I... jello, too. Oh, I don't care. Oh, and there's butterscotch ice cream. Oh, boy, huh? I love that butterscotch ice cream. How about a dish for me and one for Rex, Bernice? All right, huh? <laughs> Look at that. Rex sure loves his butterscotch. Oh, yeah, that's right. Ooh, well, what's wrong, Pops? Why did you just take doing? down my upper plate? Oh. What? I got children stuck under it. Well, would you, would you mind doing that someplace? Got a caraway Pops, seed disgusting. under there. Well. Oh, wow, well, there's enough food between my teeth to make a sandwich. Would you put your teeth back in your mouth? Oh. I may not be home until late tonight, Bernice. Oh. I, I have to go meet Mrs. Chum. Oh, is she using your poem for the October Arts Festival, Bob? Well, I don't know. I've, I've heard she's using something that... David Suizo wrote that big phony. Oh, well, that'll be oh, nice. Oh, there. <laughs> nice. I just want to see Kara. Oh, Kara, wait, see you a second. Oh, Pop. Oh, that just about drove me out of my gourd. Well. Here, Rex. Here in Hubbard Falls, Mrs. Chumley is the arts. She's involved with everything. Schools, churches, municipal stuff, women's club. I mean, if she likes you... You're in. You can do anything. You, you, can, you can do improv and performance art and song cycles, conceptual sculpture. You can do anything. Oh, but... why, hello, Bob. Mrs. Chumley, yeah. what, a, what, a, what a delight to, to, to see you. Oh, I hope you've had a chance to hear David's new song uh, collage. David. Uh, yes, we say, they say, essay. Yes. It's, yes. It's like asthma set to music. Oh, uh, what? It's, it's like it's fantastic music. Yes, it's, it's going to be performed by the Women's Chorale at the oh. Arts Festival. Oh. Did you like it? Well, it, it, it has very interesting texture. Yes, it's, it's such very... a multi-layered aspect. Yes, yes. like going back and forth with a manure spreader. And, I'm uh, so, what did you say? It has, it, has, it has a kind of a manic, a kind of a purity. Yes, uh, it uh, does, a, does kind it? Of a breath. Did, did you have a chance to look at my... At my conceptual poem, oh. my found poem, Lost Words, Found Words, uh, Mrs. Chumley. Your poem. Oh, yes, yes your poem. The yes, poem. of course. Yes, yes. I, I thought it might be something you could oh. use at the, uh, at the festival. Oh. Very, very accessible, mm. I think. Pe pe people have, have heard it, and, and they've been just amazed and moved oh. by it. Oh, who? Well, people, oh, you know, yeah. different, different people. Oh. I mean, it's a found poem, mm. so it's, it's new mm. every day. It's mm. a living thing. It's well, a kinetic Well, let me thing. think about it, Bob. Yeah. But I wanted to ask you a favor. Oh. We're going to be presenting David with the Mary Frances Foster Municipal Art Award for 2002. Oh, and that nine. Nice, yes, yeah. he carries a cash stipend of five thousand oh, dollars. How lucky for him. Yes, and I was hoping you could present it to him. Well. Yes. Yes, David. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. He's done so much, hasn't yes, he? Yes. 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 Well. And my poem? Uh, the program is rather full, oh, Bob. Uh, there's oh. a dance piece in the Civic Repertory Theater. I could make it a really short poem. Well, let me see what I can just do. Oh, why long. speak of the devil oh. here he is? Hello, David. Hey, good afternoon, Mrs. Chama. Yeah. Hi, uh, Bob. Uh, congratulations yeah. on your sound collage. Yeah. Uh, really, uh, really admire what you uh, what you did there. T just taking that little simple idea and making it into you know 20 minutes yes. worth. It's really. Quite a feat. I mean, you really you raise Xeroxing to a fine art. Uh, yeah. You must be thrilled. Well, I am. I'm yes. thrilled to pieces. Good. Good. I'll Good. use the money to spend the winter in Rome. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Have you ever received the Mary Frances Foster Municipal Art Award, Bob? Uh, not that I recall, no. No, 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 no. Bob never received it. No. It's for younger artists. Uh, Bob is more of a lifetime achievement yes. person. Yes. Thank you. Uh -huh. Well, I must be running. I'll see you tomorrow, David. Goodbye, uh, goodbye Bob. Goodbye. Bye.
Right. So, what have you been up to, Bob? Huh? Haven't seen anything of yours since that sound collage Mrs. Chumley commissioned for the Millennium. Oh, just shut up. Would the you one where you put up? the 2,000 radios along oh. Main Street. Yeah, that was quite oh. a piece. <laughs> Go away. That was just before you oh. went away for Listen, a few months. Listen, everybody's wise to you, pal. What? What are you talking I was the one about? Who, I was the one who brought sound collage to this town. I was, right. I was the one. I was the inventor. Ha. Huh? I was the initiator. I was the sound collage Go guy in this town. Pill, you stole the you? whole thing from me. Forget and then you about came it. in, you little backstabber. You stole my ideas. You bad mouthed me all over. Hey, you ingrate. Get boy, over like it. Hit you, I tell you. Just you get over it. I'm telling you, there's room for one artist in this town, and I'm it, buddies. Just pack up your tape See machine. You later. Oh, yeah, bye. Well, you care for an extra helping of the tater tot hot dish, Bob? I no. made it specially for you. No, thanks, Bernice. Oh, uh, well, I thought it came out real nice with uh, the cheese Rick's, whiz top. Oh, well, me and Rex sure liked it, didn't we, boy? Oh, huh? Yes, sir, nothing like that cheese whiz to get the old system working again. Oh, <laughs> oh. Everything you want in cheese. Bright orange, flexible, long shelf life. Mm. Makes a swell denture adhesive, too. Did, uh... <laughs> Did Mrs. Chumley call uh, Bernice by oh. any chance? Who? You mean the old flat-chested lady? No, with Mrs. The bad, Chumley. The old battle axe. Oh, well, Mrs. Chumley. Well, I found something of yours on the dining room table today, Bob. Oh, what's that? Well, I sort of like this. What? Fledgling emerald light streaming over sacred stone boats, laundry laden in the cactus tracks of raccoon passion. In the old shoe twilight. Mm. It's nice, don't you think, Pa? Mm. All I could say is if that's literature, then I'm Rhonda Fleming. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. By the way, Bob, you had a message from a Mrs. Timmy that she wants to pick up the conceptual sculpture she oh, ordered. Oh, gosh. Huh? Oh, I forgot all about it. I, I, I have to go in my studio oh, and get right. that ready. Excuse me. Oh, who am I trying to kid? How to throw all this stuff out. All these collages, all these stupid poems. What is this? A bucket of red paint? Where'd this come from? Must be left over from that 9-11 commemorative piece I did. The one that nobody noticed because that idiot Suizo and his 9-11 commemorative piece. A piece of trash that was. Oh boy, it's red, all right. I haven't worked with red in so long. The story of Bob, a young artist, was brought to you by Rainbow Motor Oil and the Rainbow family of automotive products. Join us next time when we'll hear Bob say... Yes! 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 Red! I'm done with conceptual art. I'm going to paint this town red. Out with deadness, in with redness, I say yes! That's next time on The Story of Bob, A Young Artist.